Ocean Gate Expeditions offers you the once in a lifetime opportunity to be a specially trained crew member safely diving to the Titanic wreckage site. That quarter million dollar trip may look like a luxury adventure on the surface, but beneath the waves, ask Aaron Newman, who took the Titan to the Titanic in 2021. I wouldn't call it plush, but it was very comfortable. Fully loaded with five people, the quarters are tight, he says, hot near the surface of the water and nearly freezing in the depths. Propellers to move the vehicle and their controls seem rudimentary, although he and the company insist they are adequate. Not super complicated. Uh, and, you know, so they have two sets of fans that, you know, up and down and left and right. But communications, that's another story. The craft checks in with the ship above through a text messaging system every 15 minutes, relying on that system for safety and guidance. Former Navy submarine officer Van Gurley. So all those things we're used to now with GPS and Wi-Fi and radio links uh, do not work under the ocean. And then, you know, the, the pressure is just immense. OceanGate says Titan's carbon fiber and titanium hull has proven itself against that pressure repeatedly. A monitoring system is set to warn the pilot of any problems. And even if everything else fails, Newman, who is now an investor in OceanGate, notes the vessel should drop its external weights and rise automatically. It is designed to come back up. So the fact that there seems to be no clue as to Titan's whereabouts is deeply troubling to those who know the deep ocean best. The fact that this vehicle has not come back to the surface uh, is, it does not bode well. Uh, either it's an entanglement issue or there's a broader set of uh, series of, 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 um, of failures that have it now on the bottom. Worth noting, Aaron Newman knows two of the people on this missing submersible, and he praises them as very brave in their efforts to explore the deep oceans, and he hopes to see them again very soon.